Hey, it's Asher Clover with summer DIY crafts that are so bright, they'll skip a grade. Want to post cute summery photos without breaking your Insta color aesthetic? You can buy Hold paints. On, what? Oh, uh, Insta color aesthetic. So like on Instagram, if somebody wants to maintain a color aesthetic, they'll like pick a color scheme. Really? It sounds super exhausting. It is. <laughs> so anyways, uh, you can buy the paints that match your color scheme and paint a beach ball. Okay. All right, let's get to painting. So there's already a blue side, so you won't need that blue. Yeah, this is a slightly different blue. This will match the aesthetic more. You see, it's kind of like that, that like pastel. Marginally different. Yeah, but it, it makes a difference. It's like a bright blue. That's not Is my aesthetic. Is the entire ball going to be blue? No, it's just, it's not my aesthetic. Just here, just do the this strip. Just make it a little lighter. Okay, what am I, what am I doing? Right there. I can't see the paint. You want the light blue directly next to the sky blue? No, no, put it on the, put it on there. We're covering the colors because my, my aesthetic is not primary colors. But, uh, do, do you not like this blue? I mean, it's blue. I don't like that blue. It's it's too bright. Okay. See, this all right. Is, all right. All right. All right. It's it wouldn't be a DIY if you just left the beach ball. Is that black? <laughs> <laughs> it's supposed to be a little bit more of a gray. It says midnight blue. <laughs> it's just black. That, it's, it's okay. Black enough. is in my aesthetic too. <laughs> like you know when you like post a few photos in a row and you realize like oh. Crap, I posted like two selfies in a row and you have to like Never go back happens. and delete one. Never happens. Well, because like when you're looking at the whole page, I you don't notice open like, Instagram. oh man, I posted two pictures right next to each other where I I'm wearing really pink. I really don't use social media. Uh, well, you should. It'd be great if you maybe post about the show sometimes. All right, I think one of us should be holding this steady. <laughs> Here, you hold it from that side, I'll hold it from this side. <laughs> when is bright purple part of your aesthetic? I was expecting this to be a little bit more of like a lavender color. I wanted this to be like a pastels thing. When is pastel purple part of your aesthetic? You literally never wear it. Well, it's my, the filters that I put on. on it. You know, I don't have to explain myself to you. Oops. What did you do? I did, I... Sorry. I'll fix it. Do not move. <laughs> <laughs> don't move. Don't make me look. Jesus, can you put that over there? Yes. This is taking a lot longer than it should. Well, Instagram is an art. Is this gonna be worth it? How are you supposed to become Instagram famous? Why would the beach ball be the deciding factor? <sighs> yeah, you know, there's other things. Because I can hashtag powerful. it DIY, and then that'll lead a bunch of people to my page, and they'll be like, "Oh, who's this?" Well, okay, the whole DIY on. video why, isn't on my Instagram. Why are you wearing a lei? <laughs> it's summer, what do you mean? But summer in Hawaiian doesn't exactly, they, like, they're not the yeah, same thing. Yeah, it's hot. So, I mean... People wear leis in the summer, it's a thing. No, it's not. I, I'm pretty sure people only wear leis <laughs> in Hawaii. The dollar store summer section <laughs> has so much Hawaiian stuff. I was like, yeah, pineapples meet summer. Do they at least have like watermelons and stuff? Yeah. I mean, okay. I mean, so, I mean, that's like a more summery food. They had like watermelon paper plates, and I was like, should we just like <laughs> take paper plates up? So, are these all the colors in your aesthetic? Well, now they're going to be. What were your aesthetic colors? It depends. It changes. Like, if I post like a couple pictures where I'm like wearing kind of like something that's pink, then like I'll like go on Tumblr and I'll find pictures of like pink roses and like pink neon signs and like I alternate every other photo so it's like I'll post like a picture of me and I'll post like a picture of like a coffee or like a little plant <laughs> and I'll post another picture of me and I'll post a picture that's like I'm a unicorn it's like a little you just you just go on my Instagram page go on right now you have to hold the ball I'm holding it there's literally a unicorn, okay. I'm a unicorn. I see it. And then it's a photo of me. I'm doing Black it. and white. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it's a photo I found of ice cream. Ice cream. 
Oh, yeah. hold on. Mm -hmm. Wait a second. Wait. What? Oh. So you yeah, you see when you look at it because oh, you were that scrolling. Is frustrating. When you look at it from far away. Oh. What that is so much work. Yeah. So it's like every other photo, and so it creates like a cool grid. See, that's an aesthetic. So scroll, and you can see like the colors change. Aliens. A lot of aliens. That was for Valentine's Day. Because I always do like the had like the trending hashtag. So it's like hashtag Valentine's Day, hashtag ship, hashtag I ship us, hashtag couple, hashtag couple goals, hashtag cute couple. It's a lot of hashtags. Well, yeah, because like if somebody's looking at one, it's like I don't know which one they're looking at. I want to be under all of them. Even looked up a training hashtag. How do you even do that on Instagram? Let's do hashtag summer. Hashtag summer nails. I don't think that's. Ooh, that's a good one. See. When I'm posting these pictures, I'll put hashtag summer nails. You should post more water. What? I mean, look, like hashtag summer is like every <laughs> other photo <laughs> takes place in water. So. <laughs> like go to a pool. Yeah. Or something. Well, that's a good idea. We have a beach like three miles away. What? Yeah. The beach? Three miles away? Yeah. Which beach? All of them. We're in Los Angeles. Yay! Alright. Oh, this actually turned out super cute. Yeah, that looks nice. I like it. Ta da! <laughs> Get my picture. Okay. Hashtag summer. Ready? Alright. Astrid, what the f? It was wet! Oh my god, you got it all over the carpet. Did the picture look good? Can I see the photos? <sighs> oh. Oh good, you took a burst. Oh cool, I like that one. I like the blur. Fuck. I'm sorry. Ah oh, shit. It's everywhere. God Astrid. For our next DIY, you can make a summer beer koozie using a pool noodle. Ooh. <laughs> cool. All right. How do we do this? Um, I don't know. I just, I found the, the picture on Pinterest, um, but I, I didn't find the actual Pinterest page. It was just like on Google. A beer koozie. Oh, I like that. That's all? It's probably a little taller. Okay. Yeah. Okay. About okay right we'll there. just like cut, we'll cut it there and then we'll just decorate the outside. Well, I mean, it's the, the hole on the inside. It's got to be wider. Like it's, that's not big enough for a beer. <laughs> that's the size of a beer, right? Do you want me to do that? I feel like you're gonna stab yourself. I'm fine. Here, get a beer. All right. Get like a cup. Get a couple. Bring a bottle opener, too. Okay, so now we're kind of on the right here. Yeah. Let me clean this up a bit. Okay. So yeah, cut down the center. Oh shit! I already. I forgot. I already cut the other side. <laughs> Can you, yeah, let's do that. That's not bad, actually. Here, let's, uh, let's do this. Well, score the inside a bit. That I was gonna cut myself, you literally, like, your thumb is in between the scissors. Yeah, but it's, it's not, like, a dangerous position. That looks terrifying. <laughs> Hot glue here, and then... Yeah, place here, that there. I don't know how big to, here, just put it around the. Okay. That way it's the right. All right. Okay, hold it. It's a little janky. It's not too bad. What are you doing? All right, that's not too bad. It's kind of like a flower shape. Like yeah, a... it's like a, <laughs> kind of like a clovery thing. Oh, we didn't put a bottom Clover! on it. Uh oh, uh -huh. do we need a bottom? I mean, koozies usually have bottoms. I guess uh, it doesn't need one. Yeah, but you'll see the bottom on Instagram. Cool. We have hot glue everywhere. All right, and then you can decorate it. Yeah. See that? Cool, and then you cool. Can drink your beer in yeah. style. Or if you're underage, you can do some soda. Drink so your we'll beer. just. Oh, Astrid, you hot glued it to the beer bottle. Don't. <laughs> Blame this on me. We did it together. I, you are manning the hot glue gun. Do it just harder. Just well, I don't. Well, this one beer will be very cold. Yeah, I don't want to rip it apart. It well, feels like just, it's gonna okay, fall apart. Okay, you can just you can pop the top off. You can drink the beer, and then you can pour <laughs> other drinks inside. 
This one's like pour your it's soda. so complicated. <laughs> but then, hey, um, if you're underaged and you like want to look cool, but you don't want to actually drink alcohol, you can have your beer bottle <laughs> koozie to pour your juice in, and then you can drink it from a beer bottle. We only need it for one picture. It's, so it's disposable. It's you can only use it for one beer if you it, do the, this. It's okay. The foam noodle is only a dollar. Our last summer DIY is actually two in one. We're gonna show you how to make this cute case for your sunglasses, as well as a tank top. So, since it's way too hot outside to wear long sleeve shirts, you can cut off the sleeves to make a tank top, and then we're gonna use the sleeves to make the sunglass case. Pretty nifty. Okay, what happens when the seasons change and you need long sleeve shirts again? I mean, you can just buy one <laughs> then why not just buy a sunglasses case well because the diy craft will show that you're all like cool and unique yeah but it's not unique if like you know you found it on pinterest and a million other people have already been doing it uh, well you know you could just shut the fuck glue the bottom and then you have yourself a one-of-a-kind sunglass case that looks ridiculous just <sighs> oh it's cute it's gonna be cute See? Like, Astrid, all that glue is still wet. Don't do that. Ew. No, it's... No, it's take them out. It's fine. It's, you, got, uh, you got it all over there. You can still it, see through them. <laughs> don't do... Oh, my God. Astrid. I can see. Astrid, you need to learn to let things dry. It's cute, though. It looks a little weird. I don't. I don't know. I don't like it. I. It's just. It makes me feel uncomfortable. Here, with the glasses sticking out of it. Look at how cute that is. All right, it's pretty stupid. This looks super like it's super ridiculous. We can make it like a like a like a purse. All right, I'm Here's down. Sunglasses. Why would anybody do this? Um, oh my god, you saturated the inside of this with glue. Good god, Astrid. Better than the uh, sweater candles. There we go. Sweater candles. That was, that was a right. bad we idea. The that was a fire. really bad idea. That was great. Wait, that's the bottom. That's uh, what's <laughs> okay, so you're, oh, you're saying, got it. Are you Like a purse? Yeah. Okay, so put some glue there. Oh god, less glue. Less glue. You put... Like too much. See, now here. it's one. Now it's really Hold one of a kind because we're not stop. following. Oh my god! Just... <laughs> we're not following. Just... Stop! <laughs> You're putting so much. Glue. Oh no! Oh quick, my quick. god! Quick, attach it before it jumps over. All right, hold on. Quick, Let's... quick, quick. Here, ah. just. All right. Ah, Untwist. Cool. I'm sorry. Put it's it... all over your table. Here, hold it open in the middle. <laughs> it's drying together. Um, is there so... here? Just. Just put the sunglasses. <laughs> can't get it in. The strap is very unfunctional. Oh. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> well, everybody, enjoy your summer. <laughs> Hashtag summer. Hashtag summer nails. <laughs> Hashtag summer nails.